Well, it first began as one friend thinking of another who was deployed overseas during the holidays. 17 years later, the tradition has grown into a community-wide effort to support our troops with care packages. Action News reporter Becca Hendrickson takes us to Marion Station, Montgomery County, where it all started. On the first weekend of every December, so our living room has a lot of assorted different boxes in here. The inside of Sandy and Fred Clevin's Marion Station home. These are all candy that the kids got for Halloween. Turns into an assembly line. All of these have been donated from all various sources. Donations that will go to American troops who will be deployed over the holidays. We have tasty cakes and intimates, things that make them think of home. Um, especially during Christmas when they miss their families the most. Fred started making these care packages in 2006 when he had a friend deployed. I contacted him and I said, how can I, how can I support? And that was our very first care package. Uh, 17 years later, we're over 5,000 5, now. 5,000 boxes, that is. The effort has grown exponentially over the years. When Freddie asks for something, you don't say no. <laughs> So the Clevens recruit friends from their neighborhood to the shore, each with their own reason to help. My father served. My husband's father served. We all just, it was the right thing to do. This year, this team of volunteers plans to pack over 140 pound boxes worth thousands of dollars. So it will be a holiday treat for them because they'll get it before Christmas. It's kind of amazing how quickly they get to where we want them to go. Not only are the soldiers getting snacks and toiletries, they're getting a heartfelt thank you. A letter from Fred and friendship bracelets to let them know while they can't be home for the holidays, someone is thinking of them and they're appreciated. In Marion Station, I'm Becca Hendrickson for Action News at 10 on PHL 17.